is this for all kids or there's some kids that it just doesn't work for or, or what's that all about? Uh, what are you, what are you finding? Um, well, when people say, does reading recovery work for every child? I think you have to define what work means. So to me, the short answer is no, it does not work for every child. Just like no technique is going to take away all reading problems from every child, obviously. So no, it doesn't work for every child. But um, I think you have to go back to the original purpose of what reading recovery was designed for, going back to what Maury Clay designed it for. And really the purpose of reading recovery was to decide if a child needed long-term help, did they have a learning disability where they were gonna need long-term help, or was this a child where if they got really intensive one-on-one -on -one instruct instruction that met their needs, could they reach average in their classroom in the, on the short term? And so if that's the purpose of reading recovery, yes, it, I mean, it really does work because we can decide on the short term, hey, this child really does seem to have long-term needs that some other type of help would be better for. Maybe this child needs some other kind of testing. Maybe we need to get them a different kind of intervention. And Read and Recovery has helped us identify that and gotten us more information about the child. So um, no, it's not gonna solve every child's reading problems, but it does give us more information about the child and helped us to decide if maybe they need long-term help rather than short-term help, because reading recovery is never longer than 20 weeks. Um, okay, 